Hey guys, Aisha here. Um, let me fix this camera. Let's see. Let's see if I can move this back a little bit. I um, wanted to do an Instagram live with you guys. Um, I am getting ready to go out on a date night with my man and I thought it would be fun to show you how I do my makeup with all my CoverGirl products. Um, there are only two products I'm gonna be using that aren't CoverGirl, the rest are CoverGirl, and I'll share everything that I'm using with you. Um, I just thought it would be fun to get ready with you guys. I'll look at some questions when I get a chance. I'm not the best makeup artist, so this is going for a more natural look today. Whenever I go on a date night, um, I like to keep you know, the eyes popping, but the lips kind of neutral, you know, just in case some kisses happen. <sighs> but anyway, um, let's get started. So I'm going to start out with this CoverGirl True Blend Base Business. So this is the color neutralizing. I um, just recently got thyroid surgery, and so my scar is still there. I actually want to cover it up, so I'm going to take a little bit of this. It's just green like that. And I'm going to prime this area and just sort of rub it in, just like so. And so when I go to conceal it, it's going to neutralize it. I also have a friend that decided to show up in the middle of my forehead. So I'm going to go ahead and apply the primer to that as well. And that's going to help neutralize that redness. I'm going to go around the nose area, a crow up here. That. and let it saturate. I've already washed my face um, and I went in with this um, moisturizer that I got actually from that candle company I was looking at. So I put this all over Organic Renewing Face Cream. It feels really nice, not too sticky. And then I topped it off with this Sicily Instant and Long Term. It's sort of like a primer. I really like this. So rub it in. Just like so. Hi. I'm on Instagram Live. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so, <laughs> the great thing is, yes, I covered up the mess with the rope. Stephen Curry! <laughs> Put that back on the mess and clean up your closet one time. God! <laughs> I'm doing a ponytail. Wow! <laughs> you just put me on blast. I'm doing a ponytail tonight for date night. My mom like put these little hair extensions in and I have like my little, you know, hair wrap to make sure my baby hairs don't get messed up. All right, let's get started. That's the toilet. He's going to take a poop. So I have this stuff here. It's called Tatcha the Pearl. I love this stuff. It's under eye treatment, but it has a little bit of tint in it. So it's perfect um, for when you wanna go light on your makeup and you don't wanna wear much. You can wear moisturizer and throw this on like around the nose right here and under your eye and you're good to go. So I'm gonna go ahead and put some of that on. I have a mirror down here that I'm looking at. Just like so, and it's great. I love when stuff is two in one and it's a treatment. By the way, I know I'm a cover girl. Oh! But this is not an ad. This is what I really use. Um, I'm true to everything that I market and um, talk about. And I would never um, show you guys something because it's an ad. So this is not an ad. I'm just doing this because I want to do it. All right. So I rub that on. You can see it's a little light. But once I get my foundation on, it's going to be great. Okay. Foundation time. So I am wearing, I'm going to wear my True Blend Matte Made Foundation. This is the shade T30, which I normally wear. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and put it on. And then what I like to do is I like to go in, uh, you can see it's like a very used bottle. So this is what I use every day. I like to dab it on my face like so. Put it in that area in spots. You can see. And then I'm going to blend this in. And then I have... One that's a shade darker that I'm gonna use. Let me get my brush. 
brush. We're gonna buff this into the skin. My best friend, Train just texted me and said she's laughing at my live, as I'm sure you all are, because my husband just put me on blast, and I'm sure my sister, Janice, upset, because she's the one that covered up the mess, because she said she didn't want the shade room ragging on me, because I seem to get in trouble for everything on there, um, but whatever. So, buff that in. You can see it gives such a nice, flawless buff. I forgot I had a mirror down here. I don't have to look at you guys the whole time. This brush is, oh, this is the Honest Beauty br Buffing Brush. So I think it gets my foundation on really good. Um, I've used these brushes for a long time and I really like them. All right, put that in. So now I'm gonna go in with one that's a shade darker, um, just in this area, I like to contour. I have naturally chubby cheeks and a full face, which I'm told I will appreciate when I get older. Um, but that's just what it is. I have cheekbones and I have big cheeks as well. So um, contouring is my friend and kind of just, you know, but I'm sure I'll love it when I get older. So I'm going to take this darker shade. This is T60 in Warm Sun. So I'm going to apply this down here just like so. Just in the areas. So I like to keep this part bright and light and airy. I'm gonna go on, you'll see I'm getting makeup on here. It's covering up those baby hairs that I laid earlier. So I don't mind if I get it dirty. This guy just wants to be stubborn today, huh? All right. So I'm happy with my skin. You can see it's like, Nice and glowy and dewy. Just a little more right here. So. All right, any questions? Oh, I didn't realize that anybody could request to be in the live. You know what? I'm gonna straighten y'all out. All right. Just the light there. There we go. Okay, I like this so much better. All right. So. Any questions from anybody? Go over the brow. How do you find the right foundation shade? So the great thing is with CoverGirl, um, if you go into the store, sometimes they have shade matchers and you can just match your skin up to it. But you'll notice like my skin is a lot different from what the bottle looks like. So don't be afraid of it ever being too dark. Odds are it'll be too light before it's too dark. Um, and you're supposed to test your foundation on the inside of your wrist, not on your hand, because your hand and your wrist, you'll see, look at the foundation on my hand, two totally different colors. You wanna go with the inside of your wrist and that's gonna most likely be the best match for you. Okay, so now I'm going to take a swab here and wet it a little bit. And I'm just gonna clean off my brow so that I can fill them in. Now normally, um, by this time, I would be done with my makeup, but it is date night, so I'm doing something a little special. I usually have a five minute face, and I'll share that with you guys one day soon. Um, somebody asked how I'm gonna cover my scar. I'm gonna do that last, and I'll show you, just with a little bit of the foundation in the center, blend it out, and then put a little powder over it. It won't be fully covered, but it'll be covered enough. All right, I'm gonna fill in my brows. I'm using um, my CoverGirl brow pencil. This is in the color uh, soft brown and it's the twist up. I go between soft brown and dark brown depending on what I want. Any questions? Has Ashley taught you some tips? So if you guys follow along with my makeup and stuff, you'll know Ashley Bias does my makeup almost always um, when I have shoots and events to go to and she's definitely um, taught me a lot um, about where to put the contour, where to put the blush. I used to be a hot mess. I got it now though. So that's one brow, you see the difference. I just It's just a little bolder. I like it a lot better um, when it's a little bolder, especially for a date night. So let's 
so silly of me. I don't have vibes. Hey, Stefan. 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 Yes. Are you still pooping? Why are you pooping? Hey, can you put some music on? What are you wearing, babe? Huh? What are you going to wear? Are you watching my live? Yes. Why are you watching my live? Oh my God, this is my life. Everybody just likes to put me on blast and make fun of me. So I'm the person in my family um, that I think gets made fun of the most for like everything, for words I use, things I say, faces I make. Um, what about you guys? Are you guys like the, the person that's made fun of the most in your families or are you um, the people that make fun of people in your family? All right, there's my brows. See, simple, easy, love it, love it. Let's move on to eyes. All right, so I have here, see, this is the thing. My sister said she hates when she watches people's lives and then they can't find stuff and alas, I can't find anything. So I'm gonna use this True Naked Sunsets palette first. And I'm going to take the lightest shade here and pop it all over my crease. I think Serene's watching. Is she approving this? <laughs> I hate you so much. <laughs> Stefan. Serene. Serene. Stefan thinks you're watching and he wants to know if you approve of these male overalls for him to wear. Please feel free to chime in and also join the live if you'd like so you can chew him out and tell him that's a no-go. Thank you. All right, so I'm just popping the lightest shade in the Sunset Palette all over my lid. And you can see it just brightens the eye and opens it up a little bit. I'm a one um, eyeshadow brush kind of girl, so you'll notice that I'm using the same eyeshadow brush to do the whole eye. Um, so there, lightest shade all over the lid. Any questions, guys? I'm here to answer your questions. Um, now I am going to take the Chocoholic palette. What I love about this Chocoholic palette, it smells like chocolate. So it is what it is. I'm gonna take the third shade here and pop this into my crease. We're gonna define my crease. So Riley and Ryan are in the other room with my sister and they're watching my live. So hi, baby girls. Hi, Riley. Hi, Ryan. Thank you for being good girls and not running in the bathroom. I love you guys. All right. So just defining the crease. You see the difference? All right. Okay, Stefan. Define the other crease, just like so. For me, the most important parts are lashes, and contouring and the lip so okay now I'm going to take let's let's swatch and see there's this shade I could pop all over the lid and then there's this shade that's a little more fun and sparkly oh I'm so bad at this oh my god I think I'm gonna go with the top one so I'm gonna take the middlemost shade in the Chocoholics palette and I'm going to pop it all over my lid, just like so. Yeah, I like that. So you can see their eyeshadows are really, really pigmented. You don't have to do much with them. And I love that they make it easy by showing you what colors go with what. There's really not much thought you have to put into this. Turn the camera a little bit. So there's my eyes so far. I'm going to take, go back to that sunset palette and I'm gonna take the second, uh, let's see, let's swatch. We're gonna take the third shade, the gold, because my outfit has a little bit of gold and we're gonna put it on the inner corner here, just like so. Now concealer, I'm not using a cover gold concealer so I'm not even gonna show you what it is. I'm just gonna go in with my concealer. Hi, Riley. Looking good so far? What you think? 
Uh, thank you, right? I just like to blend with my finger because the warmth, I think, from my hands warms up the product and it gets in there a little bit better, like so. And I always recommend doing your concealer after you do your eye makeup, just in case you have fallout of any kind. Date night. Date night. You excited, babe? She's right here. All right, there's my concealer. Going for that tired mom look. No, I'm just joking. All right, so now we're gonna go in and do our contour. This is my favorite part. I'm gonna use the CoverGirl True Blend um, Serving Sculpt Palette. Cause I love to serve. All right. Oh my gosh. So that color right there, and we're just gonna go in and do, you see where the cheek has a natural hollow? That's where I like to go in with the um, with the contour. So I'm gonna use this brush here, just like so. Look at that, it's my favorite part. Hi, Rai. See, so just naturally, see, look at that. A lot of people are always afraid that drugstore products aren't as pigmented as they should be, and that is not the case with this. Oh, another exciting thing is that CoverGirl recently became the largest cosmetics company in the world to become cruelty free. To become cruelty free. So they do not test on animals. They are cruelty free. Um, so we can all slay our faces and do good in the world. Again, I said this is the most important step. I wasn't lying. I love a strong contour. So there's my contour. This brush is just an Eco Tools brush. I think you can get these at Target. Wherever you want, wherever they, I mean, wherever they have Eco Tools, they I think they're they sell them everywhere. So no fancy brushes. All right, I'm gonna go down the sides of my nose now with the same CoverGirl True Blend Palette Contour Powder. Just down like that, up into the brow. So we are going to dinner tonight. I'm super excited. Um, I can't wait. Going somewhere that I've been wanting to go for a really long time. Um, this is the BH Cosmetics brush. I'm gonna go in and do some blush, again from the same palette here. All right, so now we're gonna do the lips. I'm actually gonna take this header up off. Ooh, see that sleek pony, Alker? All right, I'm gonna slick my edges here. There's nothing better than a sleek pony and some laid edges. I'll tell you that right now. All right, so this is where we're at so far. Now we're gonna do the lip. So I, I have here um, a CoverGirl Exhibitionist lip pencil, lip liner, in the color Caramel Nude. I just want to make sure that the, the pop of color that I'm going to put on my lips stays in on my lips and doesn't smudge and smear and bleed onto my foundation that I just spent so long putting on. So I'm going to go up like that. So there's the top part of my lip. And again, this is the color Caramel Nude. All right, no auto. So my top lip, I overline, and my bottom line, my bottom lip, I kind of underline, like go with the natural curve of my lip. Whereas my top lip, I go a little bit above. So those are my lined lips. I'm now gonna wear, it's date night, I'm hoping there'll be lots of kisses. Riley, don't laugh. It's for married people. It's for married people. But in order to make sure that lipstick doesn't get all over my man, I'm gonna wear my Outlast Nude. This is the color Canyon. So I'm just gonna take it, and the key with these Outlast Nudes is to let them dry for 60 seconds in order for them to last all day, 24 hours day power. So I'm gonna go ahead. Uh, it's just like a nice natural color. And I can literally eat, do whatever I have to do, and I won't have to reapply. What, what? Game Boy. What? Riley, go play with your sister. <laughs> what are you saying, Stefan? <laughs> Stefan, what do you mean everything? Nothing. What are you saying? Uh, what are you saying everything? 
looking at my face, I think I want a little bit of a dark line on my eye. So while this is drying, I'm going to go and do my line back in that Chocoholic palette. And I'm going to use the darkest shade here with a, with a makeup brush because I don't want a defined line. I just want a smudgy, um, dark line. Just like so. Perfect. All right. Yep, that's what I wanted. All right. See the difference? It's like very subtle. Um, do the other side. I'm going to take that lightest shade that we used um, in the Chocoholic palette or the bronzy shade in the middle there. And I'm just going to go clean off my brush a little bit. Okay, I'm happy with that. Okay, so the last step is, of course, a little highlight. So this is the color, um, see, beautiful, super pigmented. You saw one swipe, super pigmented. I love this freaking highlighter. Again, from the Serving Sculpt palette from CoverGirl, it's the shade, it doesn't say, it just comes in the, the, in the palette, Bloom Babe. So I'm gonna take a little fluffy brush, this is from Real Techniques, and pop it onto my cheeks here. Then you know it's sealed in, it's not going anywhere. Look at that. I'm gonna show you nothing, just a gloss, nothing. I love this stuff. All right guys, that's my makeup look. Here, I'll show you a closer look. We've got a glow going on, we've got contour, we've got a natural lip, an eye, a little eyebrow action. I've gotta finish getting dressed. Bye guys. Well, you did it, you did it, but you got me all up in my